Matthew 27 and 62. Amen. It says, Now, the next day that followed, the day of preparation, the chief priests and Pharisees came together unto Pilate, saying, Sir, re we remember that that deceiver said, while he was yet alive, after three days, I will rise again. Command, therefore, that the sepulchre be made sure until the third day, lest his disciples come by night and steal him away and say unto the people, he is risen from the dead, so that the last error shall be worse than the first. Pilate said unto them, ye have, uh, ye have a watch. Go your way. Make it as sure as you can. So they went and made the sepulchre sure, sealing the stone and setting a watch. Amen. 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 And for a few moments, I want to talk from the topic, Grave Guards. Amen. Amen. Grave Guards. Grave, G-U-A-R-D-S. Grave Guards. Those that have, were, and is today hired by the enemies of Jesus to guard the grave. Amen. 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 They had these men hired to go and to make sure that he does not come out of the grave. Amen. Amen. That's the work of the enemy. Is to make sure. Look, and not only Jesus. Right. Uh -huh. Say it, Pastor. But make sure that those of us who have reached a place where we may, where we're feeling bound and we're feeling destroyed, Come on, Pastor. Come on, Pastor. they are there to make sure you don't get out Come on, of the grave. Come on. Yeah. Amen. 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 They were hired for that. They were paid money for that. They would benefit from the fact that he don't get up. Yeah, yeah. Amen. 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 And believe me, even today, there are people yeah. that feel they benefit yeah. Yeah. from folks not getting up. Yeah. Amen. 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 Jesus came, you know, to free the people. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Before Jesus came, the only way you heard what God was saying was either through the prophets or the law. And the Pharisees and the scribes and all of them, they controlled the law. 
So you had to go to them to hear what God is saying. Amen. Amen. And then came Jesus who came and brought the truth and the light. Uh -huh. Amen. 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 Hey, like he told me, he said, I am the way. Yes, I am the, way. the truth and the light. He brought it he brought it, and all of a sudden, people became aware that they didn't have to continue living like they was living. Amen. All right, come on, Pastor. That there was another life for them. Amen. Amen. Hey, that they could all of a sudden become free. And this angered them so that they wanted him destroyed. We celebrate today as the day of his resurrection. But the word of God tell us the week before he was crucified, they were celebrating him like a king. Amen. He came into town and everybody was chill. A week later, they were screaming, kill him. They let a murderer go. Uh -huh. That he will be crucified. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Amen. Sometimes we feel like <laughs> things change in a moment's time. And all of a sudden, everybody is against us. I came to tell you today, Jesus knows exactly how that feels. Amen. Amen. To have all of a sudden the whole world turn against you. Yeah. To have the whole world look for your destruction. Amen. He was right there. He had to go through this painful ordeal to where they not only beat him, but they enjoyed it. They celebrated or celebrated torturing him. Amen. Y'all felt like that. Y'all been going through and there was folks who watching you go through and enjoying it the whole way. Amen. Watching you go through, watching you, hey, watching your pain, watching your agony, and enjoying it the whole way. They continued until they had crucified him. And here in the book it says, now the next day that followed, the day of preparation, and the preparation was what they would do to the body before they put him in the tomb. They say the next day after that, look, for them it wasn't over. <laughs> they didn't just crucify him, but you know what? The next day they woke up still plotting against Jesus. Hallelujah. They were still plotting against him the next day. They still, hey, he's still on their mind. And I'm telling you, there's people like that right now that wake up in the morning <laughs> thinking about other folks' destruction. Amen. It's people that wake up every day. Look, hey, you trying to go on about your business and they waking up in the morning thinking about what they could do next. What they've done is not enough. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They said, we got to do more. And so they went to Pilate and they said to Pilate, they said, sir, we remember that that deceiver said while he was yet alive, after three days, I will rise again. Hey, they called him a deceiver. That liar. <laughs> hey, the young folks today have called it saying he was stuck. <laughs> Amen. 
Amen. They said, we remember that that deceiver said, in three days he'll get up. Amen. Amen. Let me tell y'all something. One of the main jobs of the enemy is to make you believe that Jesus can't do what he said he can do. Do y'all know that? Amen. That is one of the hey, that is one of the main things that the enemy will